This is the Upper Craig Street. If you head up the street and then find our entrance and our Juniper Rental sign, just here. This is the communal gate. Now please enter the code that we've provided for the communal gate. Put in the code. Once you've put the code in, just turn the style around to the left hand side and pull the gate towards you. To close the gate, pull behind you and then the wee lever, just pull down to the right hand side. To exit, pull down the lever on the right and push the gate open. This is our apartment door. The key safe just on the left hand side. Just pull this flap down and then the wee lever, pull this down to reset the code. Then enter the code that we've given to you. And then turn clockwise to the right and then you can retrieve the keys. Just carefully put this wee flap back up and then close and lock to the left just behind you and just check that it's locked behind you please. There are two keys for the apartment. This key here just goes into the bottom lock and you put it in and turn to the right hand side and then this key pop it into the door turn to the right and then use the handle at the same time to open the door welcome to our apartment and once inside the apartment to lock the door we have our yield lock on the top which automatically locks behind you you can disable this if you're bringing it out just hold this down and then push the lever up and that disables the lock and then Pull this down to reset and it locks behind you. To lock the door from the inside, just turn this to the right, which locks the door, and to the left, which unlocks it. In the hallway, just in this cupboard, you just pull it open. This is location for the trip switches. Just lift this panel up, and you can see these are all in the correct position. If anything's pointing downwards, just flick it back up, uh, and the power should restart. If this is a problem and it's not working still, please get, get in contact with us and we'll get it sorted for you. And into the master bedroom. We have a lovely super king size bed. Bedside lamps on either side. And we our vacuum cleaner. Uh, iron and there's a be hanging rack here for your clothes as well. Uh, for the hot water in the property, just this dial just on the left hand side just here. What to do is just tap this boost button and you want to press it. So press it once for 15 minutes, half an hour for the second, an hour and two hours. Our cleaners will always have this set for two hours so that all the hot water is warmed up before you arrive. But just be aware that if you are going to have a shower or a bath, um, or washing dishes, just make sure that this button's pressed just to heat up the, the boiler. In the master bedroom as well, we've just got a carbon monoxide reader just here. And the light. And into the second bedroom. We've got our double bed. We've also got a chest of drawers for you, a hanging rail and our radiator. Now the radiators throughout the apartment are all the same, so you just want to make sure that this is all always left on at the wall. This radiator is currently off just now, so if you press the middle button this here, this activates the radiator and it's gone to 25 degrees. To adjust the temperature uh, up, you press the up arrow on the right hand side and then you can just click and hold the down arrow or the up arrow to your desired temperature. Into the bathroom, our light switch is just here. The fan controls are just up here, just please leave this on, it does go off after a few minutes of the light going off in the hall. Uh, the switch down at the bottom here, this is for the uh, electric radiator and bathroom, which controls the bath and the shower. The cool water for the bath, just on the left hand side, the hot on the right. 
this dial here controls the water outlet, so you go away from yourself um, for a big shower head, and then just pull towards you a little shower head. The temperature controls are just on the right hand side. Cold is away from you, and hot is towards you. You'll get to this point, and then you just have to gently push the button and it allows you to go further. Just please make sure to do small changes as the temperature does change quite quickly. And light switch. Open to our kitchen and oven. We have our fridge freezer. So the fridge section and the freezer. We have our kitchen hob just here, this is electric. Please just make sure that the switches on the side are all on. And then each of these icons represent one of the corners. So if you want to operate the bottom right one, take this one for example. Just turn the dial and then it does very quickly warm up. As you can see, and then to turn it off. For the oven just below, you want to turn this dial just here, this one's to the right. That is for the fan, and then you want to take the dial here for your temperature. Change it to any desired temperature, so in this case 200 degrees. Once it reaches this temperature, this view light goes off, indicates that you can pop the food in. And when you're finished, just pop the dials back around to the off position. For the kettle, just the dial the button just inside, and you can see the light lights up. And for the toaster, you've got this dial in the middle, just adjust this for the time duration. Then Pull down to cancel, press the cancel button. The hot water is run off the, uh, the boiler which you saw in the master bedroom, so just make sure that thermostat is pushed to get some hot water. The cold is on the right hand side and the hot on the left hand side. We have a dishwasher in the property, so click and hold this button just for a moment. You'll see it lights up. Pop the tablet in and then just close the door that starts the cycle. To cancel or put it off, just click and hold for a second, and you see it goes off. And just in this cupboard, we have our washing machine. Just take this dial, turn to your desired setting, you'll see it lights up. Pull this drawer open, we've got the main detergent in this section, and the fabric softener in this section. To open, you've just got the wee handle, and just pull. And then put it off. For the microwave, what you want to do is take the style just here, turn once to the left, and then turn to the right to the desired time. So one minute there, to, for example. Press the start button. If you want to check the food, you can hit pause, pull the door open, check the food, then press start again. If you want to add 30 seconds on automatically, press this button. And if you want to cancel completely, just press this button twice. We have a Nespresso machine for you and a welcome basket when you arrive. It has some Nespresso capsules in it. Take this lever, just lift it up. You want Hold to pop it in the shape like this is. Then just pull it down and you've got the large uh, cup on the right hand side and the small cup on the left. To fill this, you just want to pull this back a bit and then lift out. Fill this with water and then just gently back into position and pull forward. You have our general waste on the left hand side and cardboard and recycling on the right. Again, heating is controlled throughout the apartment just in the same way. Just with the down arrow on the left hand side to reduce the temperature and the up arrow on the right to increase the temperature. The television in the apartment is a smart TV. We have two remotes. This remote's for the television. So take this and put the television up. This is currently on the TV smart section. We've also got Sky installed in the property, so just press the on button just here. Just takes a second and then it comes on. Now you take this remote just here and you can use the, the down arrows you can go over to the TV guide with down, press middle select 
and again select for all the channels then you can just use the, the dials you can scroll through all the channels that are available press back that takes you back to the home menu or you can press the home button once you're in the home menu, just here, you can just use the cursor, scroll down, and we do have Netflix installed on the TV, so enjoy it watching some Netflix. So you can just use the cursor and scroll through all the different shows that are available. Press menu to go back, and when you're done, just the off button, just at the top. And then just pop the television off as well with this button. power for the television is just on this switch here so just make sure that this switch is always left on that can controls the TV power. We've also got our cleaning cupboard, we've got an ironing board, a drying rack just behind here and mop bucket. And when departing the old lock locks itself automatically so if you take the bottom key for me please pop into the door. Just turn around to the left, and that locks the door behind you. Pull the key safe, and then just pull the flap down, reset the code, and then enter the code that we provided. And then again, turn clockwise to open the key safe, pull this one further down, and then just replace the keys. And just check that it's locked behind you. Thank you for staying with us at Juniper Rentals. We hope you had a lovely stay. And we hope to welcome you back soon.